so we're, we, yeah, but we're talking about odds of rain today and then pretty high. Those are pretty high, especially <laughs> later on today. I mean, we're just tracking a few rain showers sliding on through right now. Those are now continuing to push our way through Washington County, Frederick County, Maryland too. to see a few of those slide through Loudoun as well as Montgomery County. But most of those continue to exit off towards the north and east. So zooming on in, then we do have this batch of uh, that rain just to the west of Middletown there, and that's a bit more on the steadier side as opposed to light. Cold front will continue to slide its way through. That will spark up some more rain chances through the day today. So expect to be driving in and out of those rain showers through the afternoon. And then eventually it should taper by the evening before more rain is expected overnight and into tomorrow. Temperatures right now starting off a little bit warmer than yesterday. We're into those middle 40s for most locations. 46 right now in D.C. We are 45 in Annapolis. 46 over towards Hagerstown. We're seeing those middle 40s also back up and down the I-81 corridor too. Highs today, those will vary into those low to mid 50s as you get closer towards the I-95 corridor. It's farther back over towards the mountains where we will likely see those temperatures jump into those lower 60s considering the rain will likely hold off there aside from maybe that passing shower. And also we could break out into some sunshine later on today there. Coastal flood alerts to talk about. These are not associated with the rain. This is more so associated with that full moon and the higher than normal high tide cycle. So today we have that coastal flood now advisory. It was that coastal flood warning earlier this morning that it expired at 6 a.m. for St. Mary's County. We still have that coastal flood warning though for Anne Arundel County and then back over towards D.C. as well. That goes through the afternoon. Then back over towards Fairfax County and even down towards Stafford County, King George County, even over towards Charles County too. We do have that coastal flood advisory through the middle of the afternoon today. Future cast shows us that we are going to continue to notice some green on the map, indicating scattered rain showers through the day today. We'll also see those mainly cloudy skies too. Temperatures, those, like I mentioned, will vary into those 50s for most. And then as we look ahead towards later on this evening, those showers will continue to start to push their way farther off towards the east and towards the south. So a little bit of a lull in the action later on this evening and early tonight before more rain starts to be pushed its way back in from the south and east and moves its way farther off towards the north and west. Looks like the outer fringes of it will be towards Hagerstown before eventually that subsides and continues to start to exit off towards the east. Now it's also see with a system that will climb right along the cold front that will swing through and I'll bring us some more rain chances for Thursday that exits and Friday it is dry. We'll see a bit more of that sunshine and high temperatures. Those will likely be right around 60 degrees. There is that spot shower chance on Saturday, not a washout by any means. Now it looks like on Sunday any shower threat will be later on in the evening, so we should be seeing uh, some drier conditions at least for parts of our Sunday as well. So in terms of temperatures, though, we're looking at those 50s, at least lower 50s today and tomorrow with the clouds and those rain chances. Friday, it is dry, breezy, but we'll see those temperatures a little bit warmer, lower 60s. We're also tracking the 60s this weekend. Does look a little bit warmer now on Sunday with the latest model updates. We're looking at those mid to upper 60s on Sunday, and then we're right back at it into those upper 50s on Monday with those isolated showers, scattered showers as we get towards next Tuesday. Shanika, what's the latest on the roadways? All right, good morning, Jeff.